Hi, welcome again. Uh, today we will do same as we did before, like uh, determine the shear force and bending moment with this beam. So uh, here is the today the load is changed. Here is not urea. Okay. So this is triangle force. So we change to this force as point load. We'll draw the pre body diagram and uh, then we will solve our question this is our b so here is c this one is three meter the other one is also three meter okay and the eul we will change this to point load so we will uh, change this force to like this okay and then divide by two so we will remove this side like 9 multiplied by 3 is 27 and 27 divided by 2 is 13.5 or oh, where will be this 13.5 will be located so where the maximum force there will be the resultant force so uh, the center of gravity is this triangle is here so this will be 3 divided by 3 so it's mean 1 meter okay same the other side is also so it's also 1 meter okay the center of gravity of triangle is 1 over 3 that's why we did here okay this distance is 1 over 3 so that's why uh, we find the center of gravity of this uh, forces here it's one meter okay here is uh, the is roller support is ruler so it's one unknown and here is spin so here is two unknown okay the axis is n y axis so first find the support so f of x we will apply f of x right to the positive there is no x forces that's why the a x will be zero okay same use f of y upward positive so the a y is going upward and the b y is also going upward and the 13.5 is going downward the same 13.5 is going downward equal to zero these two will be go to the outside uh, so the right side so it should be 27 and that should be equal to a y plus b y okay so here this this one is 13.5 and same 13. .5. so the total of a y and b y is 27 so we'll find the a y then we will solve for b y yeah or vice versa so try to moment here a the b will be this side the uh, one this side and the single one is also this side look at this big diagram you understand okay moment a this one is positive doesn't make any difference okay so b y is multiplied by six total distance and this one will be negative the other will be positive 13.5 multiply by the one is 2 and the second one this will be positive 13.5 here is 1 and total 3 so it's 4 okay equal to 0 this one will be uh, something and this one is the total of uh, 81 okay and this one will go to the outside so it will be by and divided by 6 so by will be 13.5 so if you put 13.5 is here the other will be also 13.5 so ay by equal to 13.5 okay now find the shear force and bending moment okay just move to the another slide we did it this okay and what we will be doing just cut this beam at c point where they want the shear force and bending moment okay so I'll draw here the beam again and you will see this is our beam this is the c point this one is 13.5 this one is also 13.5 this one is ay and this one is by we find the ay by is also 13.5 and 13.5 now cut it c Okay, you take the right side or left side it doesn't make any difference but you have to care about the uh, sign convention okay so this is our c point so it's three meter okay 
and here is AAC0 and this one is AY is 13.5 and here is the shear force and this one is normal and moment okay shear force will be equal to f of y upward positive so v is going downward so it will be negative upward 13.5 and there is no other force equal to zero so v equal to 13.5 kilo okay now apply the moment equation let's see this one is vc this one will be mc mc okay uh, that direction is positive because we cut it uh, we take the left side okay now find m c is positive and the other one is negative 13.5 multiplied by 3 okay uh, this one will be equal to 0 okay so what will we do this the mc is positive and this one is negative oh sorry here is also one force which is this one we change this ul to the point loop so it's also will be included so it means here just here is this okay and this will be positive 13.5 multiply by one equal to zero this one will be something mc negative 40 Point seven five something so five and plus thirteen point five equal to zero. So this will need to be the outside and this one will be, this one will be positive and this one will be negative. So MC is equal to twenty seven. Okay, this one is forty or oh, nothing. Uh, let me try thirteen point five multiplied by three. So it's forty point five. Yes, minus thirteen point five. So this is 27, yes. So the moment is 13.7 kN per meter. Let me draw the shear force and bend the moment. This one will be. Okay. 1 will be 1. Okay. This one will be the bending moment. And the shear force will be equal to this one is going up. Then straight, no straight. Let's go down. Okay. And then go another down and this one yes like that okay this one is negative this one is positive this one is shear force and this one is minimum these two is dry ground it finds c okay that's the end of the video and this is our final answer